Hi everybody, Lauren DeLucia here, your Pampered Chef consultant. If you're watching this video, you probably own some Pampered Chef and you probably love it. So I want to share with you today nine products that I absolutely love and I use almost on a daily basis. So let's get started. First I have the measuring spoon set. It has six spoons starting with an eighth of a teaspoon all the way up to a tablespoon. Now I was just using these so these are a little wet. But it easily goes into a spice jar. I love this. Watch this. This is the tablespoon. So you don't have to worry about pouring the spice over a spoon set that's all attached. You're getting it all over your table. This is super easy, easy to wash. You only have to wash what you use. Next is our flexible cutting mat set. Um, it comes in a set of three. Right now I have one at the camper. Um, I love this because you can pound your chicken breasts. You can make your hamburger um, hamburgers and mold them here with the chop meat. You can dice and cut your vegetables, your fruits. You can prep your smoothies on here. I'll prep your juices to juice with on here. Um, I also like that you can, once you're done, you can just kind of fold it and then pour it into your blender or your bowl, whatever you're, you're putting it into, or your pot. Um, so I really like this. Dishwasher safe, easy to clean. Next is our colorful kitchen utensil set. Comes in a set of four. Okay, they're the perfect size. The edges for eggs, for omelets, for pancakes, for sauces, for soups. It also feels very comfortable here. I owned a few from the dollar store and I just didn't like the way they felt with, when I, while I was cooking. And I got these as a surprise. I had a party for a friend. These were on my wish list. And then when my um, goodies came, these came too. So it was a gift from her. So I really like these. These are special. Next is our garlic press, okay? I love this tool. So all you need to do is put your clove in with the skin on. You don't have to peel it off, dice it off, slice it off, try and get to it. Your, your cuticles don't burn, okay? All you do is put it in with the skin on and push down and your garlic comes out. I really like this because um, I use this in salads. You'd never know, but this um, is so flavorful um, with your sa salad and lettuce and tomatoes and olives. Then you put this in with some dressing and mix it all together. Nobody knows that they're eating raw garlic and it just makes the salad just a little zingy and gives it a pop. Here's our manual food processor. It has three parts, actually four. Here's a manual motor inside of here and a blade, blade system, very sharp. So if you get this and you're washing it, just be careful. Um, so you put the top on. You can make in here salsas, guacamole. Um, you can chop chocolate in here, chop carrots, peppers, onions. I especially love onions because you just chop it roughly in three, throw it in, pump it a few times, okay, very easy, and then you're done. No electric needed. Um, it's, it's a fun tool to use. I also put olives in here, um, super easy to chop in like three or four pumps, the olives are done. Mushrooms too. And when you're done with that and you have your food in here and you might have leftovers or want more for the next day, you just put the cover on and pop it in your fridge and it stays nice and fresh. Okay, next is our can opener. So this tool is amazing. It has a mechanism right here that catches the edge of the can um, and then you'll feel it start to grip and you just start turning, okay? It's for lefties and righties. And you'll feel the can, after it's done a full circle, start to turn a little easier. And that's when you know that it's time to take the lid off. Okay, so here we go. It's turning a little easier. So I reverse it counterclockwise a little and it releases. And then I take this edge right here and I grab it and get a good grip and the top comes right off, okay? There's no sharp edges whatsoever. It's great for your recycling bin, okay? No sharp edges here either. And you feel very comfortable and safe that you're not getting any metal anywhere. So that's our can opener, okay? Next is our glass mixing bowl set, set of three. I love this. It's freezer safe, microwave safe, oven safe up to 350 degrees. Um, 
I wanted the KitchenAid mixer and I saw the price and I just then bought a um, $35 hand mixer to go with the largest bowl and I mix all of my baking ingredients in this one and it doesn't splatter it's high enough it keeps all my ingredients inside even pancake mix cake batter mix um, also this is our silicone flexible silicone lid set it's sold separately so I use these for uh, beans that I cooked and I want to freeze or leftovers, chili, meals for um, a couple days in. I make it on a Sunday and I want to eat it on a Thursday. I pop it in the freezer. Then I just defrost it out here. Super safe. Also this lid. I love this lid because if you're making pasta or salad and it's overflowing, this lid will fit around the edges and the food can rise up in the middle. Okay, so it, it keeps everything actually um, contained. Also, there's this little lip here, so you can either let steam release or you can keep it super fresh and airtight and pop it back in. Okay, so that's our glass mixing bowl set. Next is our deluxe cooking blender. This is a lot of fun. Um, here is our smoothie cup and adapter as well. Let's go over the blender first. Um, it's on right now. You turn it, the top, and it will let you know that it's unlocked, and this will let you know that it's locked. You can make heated soups in here, um, and it takes about 30 minutes, but it will puree raw vegetables for you to make a healthy homemade soup. You can make alternative milks in here like rice milk, almond milk, hemp milk. I love that. Also, um, you can make smoothies your own recipes or find them on Pinterest. That's a lot of fun. That's my go-to Pinterest. Um, you can make milkshakes in here. You can make peanut butters in here. Almond butter, sunflower butter, almond um, peanut butter. You can make homemade sauces in here, tomato sauce. You can make jams. Um, there's a heated puree button as well, a soup button, a grind button. You can grind up anything that's hard like chocolate chips. Um, and uh, also this recipe book has, of course, recipes and also directions. I, this is like my Bible. So it shows you certain settings and how to set it, um, how to, how, its safety features and how to use it. And here's our smoothie cup and adapter. I like this because this is for one person. You fill it up with your ingredients, frozen, fresh, cold. You pop it on. Okay, you take off the top glass pitcher which also has a heated wash mechanism so you don't have to rinse this big pitcher underneath the sink you just fill it up with water press the heated wash button and it he heats up the water and cleans it for you so you're not there under the sink scrubbing so here's our adapter for our smoothie cup okay and you just lock it in there's there's that noise again it lets you know that it's ready to set it and then you have a smoothie every morning for yourself I like that a lot. Here's our quick cooker. I use this a lot right now. There's beans inside. So the pressure has released. Okay. And now it has cooked. My house is not hot from having it on. If I had beans cooking for 45, 50 minutes, my house would have been really hot. So right now there's black beans ready to go. Release the pressure and close it. Okay. Also, you can make seafood in here. It has a setting for beef, chicken, beans, stews, chilies, desserts. I've made pastas in here, rice in here, chicken and lemon sauce in here. Um, I've made homemade broths, vegetable, and chicken stock. Um, it's amazing. My favorite go-to meal, though, in here is chili. And finally, our air fryer. The air fryer also comes with a guide on how to use it because everything cooks up just a little bit differently time-wise. Um, I've made in here already fresh chicken, beef satay, um, uh, homemade uh, potato wedges, okay? It, I've also heated up like chicken tenders for the kids and beer battered shrimp and beer battered fish and frozen um, french fries all coming out delicious. It comes with Two cooking trays inside, okay, a drip pan at the bottom. There's no smoke whatsoever. Your house doesn't get heat hot with this. You just keep it a few inches away from your wall, about six to eight inches, 
and heat is released on the outside. Lots of safety features here too. Um, there's a reheat button, a dehydrate button. You can make apple sliced apples in here, bananas in here, and they become dehydrated. Also, there's a bake button, an air fry button, a roast button. There's a basket, okay, that rotates. There's a rotisserie tool for your chicken, your whole chicken that you can put in. And then there's a retrieval tool as well. So these three appliances are my go-tos a couple of times a week, depending on what I'm making. And I really hope that you enjoyed this video. And um, check back and find me on Facebook and Pinterest at Mountain Meals with Lauren. Thanks again.